um, since the castle, I'm assuming you guys probably rested up if you needed to. Did right. you? I yeah. I need to uh, refresh my rage rounds, so. I mean, then, yeah. I'm cool with that. Help me up before we're dead. That we didn't drag out there. the corpses, set them on fire, that sort of thing. Mm -hmm. yep. Um. Then yeah, it's been a day, so you guys are rested up, but. Awesome. All right. Uh, I look at the group and I say, "Want to wait a little until till we uh, see the mist head out, or do we just want to power through?" Uh, let's power through. Alrighty. I mean, what's the let worst you. that could happen? <laughs> let no mist stand in our way. Hmm. All right. Outwardly, I don't have any reaction. Inwardly, I just think, well, they knew. They knew. <laughs> oh. Unless they knew better, it's more, we just don't trust you as far as we could throw you. Even though I healed you, I made some spells that saved you more it's or less, less. It's more, you can't expect someone to trust. Like, sure, you healed me, definitely. But I have seen clerics, or at least... I have seen clerics and oracles that have been like, oh yeah, no, I, I'll heal you. And then at the time where you truly really needed them, they were gone. So Orin at least doesn't trust you as far as he could throw you just now. He's ha he's thankful he saved his life, which is why you're not eaten yet. Perno <laughs> just loves the fact that you get really annoyed when nobody trusts you, so that's why he's playing along with this. That too. Sinel <laughs> uh, is in the police force, he's uh, usually very paranoid about who to trust. Yeah. Which is why he only That's trusts his... Uh, no, Mar no, mind you guys, you guys have proof that Merlo is like, at least like, had been influenced by this evil conspiracy. Don't forget that. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Maybe no, man, he's the one made behind it all. This is where we find out that he is actually the... <laughs> he is actually the bad guy. He's actually yeah. the level 20 bad guy. Yep. I've been holding back all this time. Insta oh my god! <laughs> and what's me he, off he, Hey look! Orin's been wished out of existence. Who's Orin? He fell into the crack in the wall. <laughs> oh, good, 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 good luck with getting through the mist. I'll be fine with my vision. <laughs> oh, I... I Orin just Orin stops, looks at looks at Ashiranti, is like, "Holy shit! Even I felt the goddamn saltiness right there. Jesus, I never feel that shit." So um, that was an incorrect scrap. Blind sense helps you see things, not as much terrain. Yeah, uh, well, effectively, what it does, it allows you to get a rough. It's like sonar, I think. Yeah. How it works. So then. Ashranti, roll me survival. Very well, I'm gonna cast my Actually, no, roll me perception instead. Cool, I'm gonna cast guidance before that. Nope. No. Why not? Because guidance is something like you have to actively know you're gonna be doing something and then do it, but a reaction thing, you can't say, oh, suddenly, like, pass immediate <sighs> action guidance. Fuck you. It's essentially. If you're going to search a room, like you've cast it before, yeah. but if you like go back in a room you you didn't see anything last time, then it's like you can't really prepare. I rolled for that. 33, so get fucked. <laughs> oh my god! Oh Matt, shower me with salt. Do I need to grab the? Do I need to grab my French fries? Holy shit, man! <laughs> Matt, <laughs> Jesus. You you sense you're not quite sure what it is, but there seems to be something thirty feet ahead. Okay. I say, there might be something ahead. Alright, what is it? Is it a tree? I don't know. There's something. Descriptive. Alright, keep your eyes open, guys. So oh yes, I see mist. <laughs> yeah, I see a lot of mist. Was that what you wanted to see, Oren? Uh, I don't know. I, all I see is mist myself, so... As a continue on, Oren. Roll me reflex. Alrighty. Give me one As 
You go to step, and there seems to be nothing there. Uh, reflex it is. There's my reflex. It is a very decent reflex. It's not a hard save to not step forward. You were able to not step forward off the cliff. Yay! <laughs> you see, kind of next to you, there seems to be a rather thin path just kind of going up, assumedly towards the next mountain. Hmm. I, I, I seem to notice that there is a, uh, uh, a ledge here you might not want to fall off like I almost did. Um, Merla looks at Ashiranti. I thought you said there was something here. Looks like nothing to me. <laughs> I, look, I look down the cliff. Great. <laughs> point to the point to the path. Yeah, I, I point. Point to the path. I look at the path. Your point being. <laughs> I think I think Ashiranti's just a little sad. It's fine. She'll get over the sand in her vagina. Um, All right, guys, let's oh, go. Oh fuck! Oh, <laughs> it's pretty much really good. Feel, feel the salt. <laughs> oh my god. Mm. <laughs> I'm, so really I'm being irritated from the very start. Don't know why, but it's getting worse. I have noticed that we losing fucking time. Okay, we go along the path, I suppose. Ready? Mm -hmm. All right. How quickly are you moving along the path? Normal speed? Probably, uh, if it's a shall, if it's like a narrow path. It is. Yeah, I would probably slow down to at least half speed. Okay. Uh, everyone slow down half speed. Yes. I'm assuming because you're behind him, but yes, like we're not gonna run past him for no good reason. <laughs> That'd be great. That would be an acrobatics check to get past him. Mm. And we fail and we fall down. A cliff. Everybody looks at me. <laughs> yeah, everybody rolls, he just, everybody fails. He just spider climbs over everyone. <laughs> mm. Spider Sam, Spider Sam. <laughs> Sam. Well, it only takes a couple minutes, but you start seeing, like, not as much like light as like pure sunlight, but you see more light than you have in the mist, normal than you had in the mist before. What kind of light? A white light. Is it like a, a dancing kind of light? No, it's just kind of permeating the mist. Okay. So it's not moving. No. Well, it's moving when you move. Hmm. Interesting. Right. Uh, somebody check if that is a magical light. Um, I have no spells of that nature. I look at the oracle. And I tilt my head. You are surrounded by transmutation magic. Ooh. It's almost like oh, it's... Oh, yeah. A fog. <laughs> <laughs> Mm. No, I was expecting, please, would you kindly? Oh. <laughs> I don't think that's our style here. <laughs> so we have nobody competent enough to cast sea magic. Fuck. Nope. <laughs> Try it. Uh, check if, it, uh, if it's magic light, if you'll be so kind. If Holy, you no. Holy you. Samuel, since when have you learned manners? My God! Yeah. And no, I should write, you know, you I have know. to ask him to get down on his knees and kiss your foot. <laughs> uh, some people can learn, apparently. Uh, unlike you two, I have a family. <laughs> you do? Then why are you here, for Christ's sake? I didn't know you had a family. Yeah, it's like you have a family. <laughs> Even the DM I, didn't I, know. <laughs> how come my uncle has my family? Okay. Oh, yeah, okay. By the way, <laughs> he might be like dead. And stuff like that. <laughs> my foster father. You seem to be surrounded by control weather. Hmm. Yes, it is a control weather thing. So it's probably not going anywhere. Hmm. Alright. I guess we start them moving towards the light. 
Driven to the light. And I'm waiting for Orion. Yeah, I start heading forward. Again, slow movement, but still I move forward. Into the light. After about another minute, you break out of the fog, and you see the path continues on a ways until it widens up up next to another mountain. Another mountain? This seems like a small pass just connecting two mountains. Huh. That is actually hilarious. Hmm. All right. Keep your eyes open. This is this Ogre territory. Is oh, well. Mm. As you see that, wrongly perception. Everybody. Uh, uh, everyone, or just... Just, just Samuel. All, All right. right. Uh, perception. God, yes. I got fine strike. I am a happy camper. 23. Also... Does Orin have a Hammer the Gap? Hammer mm. the Gap? I don't think I do. Like, how many attacks do you get, like, maximum? Maximum? Uh, let me find it. Let me find my... At absolute full maximum, it is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 7, currently. 7 attacks. That would be 13, 20... I think that's what twenty-eight extra damage or something like that. If you hit all of them, holy shit! It's like plus one, and like it's plus one, plus two, plus three, plus four for every attack like you hit. So, oh god, Jesus. Samuel, you see a sign. Oh my fucking god! <laughs> <laughs> oh no! <laughs> do you point it up? Do you point it up to the <laughs> others? Hey, point at the sign. We should take. You guys see a sign at the end of this path that says "Beware Ogres." Well, this might be an evidence that we are on the right. <laughs> it seems to be written in, but common, but horribly written, like a four-year-old did it. God dang it! Well, I'm still surprised uh, some of these uh, peasants can actually read or write. Aren't you the most peasant of all of us, okay. Mr. Guardsman? Uh, we in Sandpoint uh, pride ourselves in uh, our schooling. <laughs> Lack of or actual school? <laughs> I mean, they have an orphanage that yeah. is a school, so they've got, like, K through 8. You're certainly asking for a fight. <laughs> mm. I'm not actually sure who would win that one. <laughs> yeah, I don't think I'd question Actually, it. Like, if I... Actually, we haven't actually sparred with each other, have we? Have we? No, so, we haven't. I'm not very good at holding Are we, we going to have the... I mean... I'm always, you guys know me, I'm always up for people having a fight with one another. But can we do that a little like, later? Yeah, like next level, I'm right. sure so I can. You guys level, I think we're I'm assuming you guys continue on past to the side. Mm -hmm. Do you start being yeah. careful to not make as much noise, or are you trying to move as quickly as possible? Uh, I'm as going as safely again. possible. Like, I, again, I I'm say, prioritizing safety. With... Hmm? But you just, yes, I was about to say, we're Colbert with us. We have no chance of being silent. But then I realized Colbert <coughs> is dead, so we actually are quite silent, aren't we? Mm. Well, unless you guys start yelling and it starts echoing across the mountains. I mean, I still, we'd still be more silent than if Colbert were walking close to us. Mm. <laughs> That's mean. <laughs> anyway, do we keep going? But it's dead. <laughs> I mean, I'd be hearing it now if we actually complain. <laughs> anyway. <laughs> so, what happens next? You guys continue on? Yes. Uh, yeah, probably. Do you want me to, by the way, send you the spells that I have prepared for the day? Um, if you want. Yes, I like doing that. 
because that makes it all a little bit fairer, in my personal opinion. Oh, wait. Uh, nope, that's the wrong one. Uh, carry on, then. I'll just be done in a little bit. All right. Well, you guys continue on, and... Is it mostly just kind of paths, and you eventually reach a wall. Path just kind of ends, and there's like a small cave. It it doesn't look like an ogre could fit in this cave. Hmm. Hmm. I had the I had the go boat to what say we take a look inside? Maybe it's the cover system where ogres are. Who knows? I look at the Orin and the Merlot. Sure. Orin nods. Um, want me to go first? Well, I guess you can see in the darkness. He nods. Good. Right. Then you uh, take point. Will do. Um... Before I head in, I chug uh, a potion uh, or an extract of heightened awareness and then saunter in. I just got it, guidance on myself if, in case perception would be. <clears throat> As you go in to the cave, you could roll me survival if you wish, but I will need fortitudes. For everyone that goes in. Forty, dude. Yep. Do I also need to roll survival or on the Orin because it's leading? No, if you jump into, well, I know anyone can. Fortitude, but who rolls for survival on the Orin or me too? No oh, wait, not this. Uh, for defenses. Wow, Merlot. <laughs> wow. That's, for you, dude. <laughs> That's my fortitude. Like the, yeah, your fortitude is one worse than mine, but you rolled a 20. So. <laughs> also, is anyone bringing any light into the cave? Actually, I crack, on I, crack up. I crack up by my sun rod. Okay. I have dark vision and blind sense, so... Merlot, what do you use for light? Are you just I mean, going fight. off the sun, sun rod as well? Yeah. Alright. Um, or in a shot and... I don't see a survival for her, so I'm going to assume ah, she didn't yeah. roll it. Yeah, because you didn't say if I have to roll well, it. I said everyone can, if they want. It, but... it. Oh, okay. Sorry. I'm not that proficient in survival, so I'll pass. Well... Due to the air light almost smells awful. And as you notice that, Merlo just almost seems like he's about to throw up. Merlo, you're sickened. Hey, what's that minus two on everything or just one move action? That's the minus two on everything. The one action is staggered. Okay. I don't think I have a spell to help you with that. Hey, I'm gonna be sick. Yeah, because Niche Rise Poison doesn't work with it. Uh, yeah, I don't have a spell for sick and status. Hey. But I'm pretty sure we both know that it smells so bad that this is like a dump for ogres, or like bodies are here or something. Or what? No, it, it almost seems like there's just something in the air. Hmm. I look at uh, Ashiranti and I say, uh, think you could check for magic? Yeah, I have the text magic on. Cast it after guidance. Yeah, because that's how I would be fighting. 
There doesn't seem to be any magic. It does and not appear to be magical in nature. Hmm. Well, maybe just someone took a very rancid piss in the area. Let's go. I say as he begin walking forward. <laughs> oh, the joy. Technically, it's CR4 because I made it flammable gas, but the DC for non flammable gas is the same as for flammable gas, so it's fucking CR1. <laughs> oh, the sudden DC. Is it like A? The DC is 15 plus 1 for every previous check. Ah, oh, okay, so it's not that easy to, fa to, to succeed. Mm. But yeah. <sighs> Oh, wait, 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 with all of these checks, like, what kind of check would it be to raise that, hey, this might be a flammable stuff in the air? Uh, knowledge nature. I Ooh. believe I have knowledge nature. I do as well, yeah. actually. Um, let me go, there we go, plus two. You were both oh, able to work out great. that the smell, why plus two? Just curious. Oh, plus two is for heightened awareness. Oh, nifty. You get that on knowledge checks? Um, you enter a state of awareness that allows you to notice more about your surroundings and recall information effortlessly. Oh, nifty. I, didn't, I, I knew it did perception. It did knowledge checks. Nice. Yeah, you gain plus two competence bonus on perception checks and on all knowledge checks that you are trained in. If this spell is active when you have to make an initiative check, you can instantly dismiss this spell and gain a plus four bonus on that check. Yeah, and it did the initiative and perception. It did knowledge too. Nice. That's mm -hmm. a fun spell. It um, is. You guys are able to work, both work out that what you smell actually seems to be almost like the smell of rotten eggs. I, I, I turn to the group and I like pull out flint and steel. I'm like, guys, you got to see this. And I go to strike it. Don't. Or at least I begin to make those movements. Nope. Don't. All right. It's flammable. Oh, no. But. And I Come on. And I, I got a good idea. Could you wait like five minutes? Everyone, run for your life. We're just going to get a better view of this no. if we run out of the cave and watch it or blows mean, himself to pieces. I mean, no, you, I'm guys, a joke. you guys will probably survive. The maximum damage you could do is 36. <laughs> I will be fine. Hmm. Out of character, <laughs> I would promise to Orion that I would use my healing spells like channel energies and I would select him to not be included. Well, that well, doesn't matter because I heal on my own anyway. <laughs> yeah, no, that's the best. No, but I'm, I'm, just, I'm just making a joke. And I'm just, I like go for like, eh, 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 and then slowly put them away. So yeah. you, you do smell sulfur, and while sulfur itself isn't flammable, it's usually used by miners' mines to kind of tell them where methane is, which right. by itself doesn't have much of a smell. Which is why all miners are drug addicts, right? Pretty um, much. I think uh, I look at the group, I look at Merlot, and I say, uh, you want to head back outside or want to carry on? Uh, let's just keep going. I will have to go through here anyway. <laughs> Alrighty. Let's see if we can walk uh, forward. Have just stopped following the path, but... <laughs> well, I think this is the right path, you know. Hmm. I mean, you could have just decided to go directly towards it instead of wandering around paths. <laughs> yeah, we're lost as fuck. <laughs> anyway. Romy survival. Be less being lost, it's more just going wherever the road takes us. As you start going through the caves and there are multiple paths. Alright, survival. It's survival first good roll of the night. That nobody will listen to me, as they already stated, so I'm not gonna... You feel a breeze, well, not much of a breeze, but the flow of air coming from one of the tunnels, and I'm assuming you go down it. Mm -hmm. I make a, a hand motion to this you kind of look around. I have no recollection of this place. It says he keeps on, keeps on walking. I guess I follow. Uh, 
Hitting the breeze of the air. Alright. We shall see if this will be it. Speaking of, how are we walking? Is it like Orin at front and then Ashiranti second or Ashiranti at the back? I would like a me second since I'm a striker. I mean, I'm pretty right. sure it would be Orin first, Ashiranti standing behind here, you know, both of them tracking the way. And probably, I don't know who comes afterward. You, would you go before me or behind me, Samuel? I mean, before. Believe it or not, um, believe it or not, being next to me is probably the safest. Yeah, I know. That's why I meant, like, you're both looking at it. Ashiranti can see through everything, mm -hmm. essentially. Yeah, so, as you I guys mean... are continuing on, you see more and more rocks on the floor. Hmm. Does anyone have knowledge of engineering? What? We see rocks? You could do knowledge engineering nope. or craft stone masonry, and you can do craft checks untrained. Might right. as well okay. try because I don't have minus three or just just regular one d twenty. One d twenty plus intelligence. I have craft oh, alchemy, okay. but not uh, not craft stone masonry. So just a flat d twenty plus three. Oh. Same here. <laughs> I I wrote I think. Plus plus. Okay, that's the reason. It's not that I have zero. You rolled zero. <laughs> nah, that's exactly what happened. Samuel? I didn't pick anything on craft, so... Well, you can still roll a d20 plus intelligence. Jesus Christ, everybody rolled on d20. No, wait. Yeah, it's I rolled good the first time, but I fucked up the roll, so it doesn't matter. Alright. Oren, roll me perception. Sure. Uh, with the plus two. How long have we been walking for up till now? Um, how long since you casted Heightened Awareness? At the beginning of the cave. Uh, how long does it last? Ten minutes per level, so currently 40 minutes. 40? Um, it's probably been about 15 minutes, so let me start right. it. Or is. You're, you go and you start walking by it, and then you stop and you notice that in the light of the sunlight, there seems to be a glint in the wall. Hey, guys, take a look at this. I say as I point at the glint. It seems to be a gem of some sort. Detects magic. Um, oh, it is not magical. Can I check whether it's trapped? Because I don't trust this shit. Yes. It's not Ready? logical, I say. That would be it's... another perception. Hmm, strange. Can I also do that if I, like, focus on... on it doesn't seem to be trapped. Right. Can I make a... Um... <laughs> roll it! Demon, like, demon mat. Like, you want to roll perception? Roll perception, damn. Ooh, bad roll. I'm not gonna say you can't roll something. Um... 22, it doesn't seem to be trapped. Alright. Uh, I give it like a, a tap. The gem a tap to kind of... Hard enough that a normal rock might be able... Because I think the hardness between actual gemstones and rocks is different. So, kind of to get a feeling of whether it's real or not. Actually, that might be an appraise check. It seems real and roll me strength. Before I do that, though, or are you taking a 10 or like a 20 on it? Oh, no, no. I'm just... Uh, this is just in... I just look at it, try to get an idea for the appraise. It, and... it seems like you can sell it for a decent bit. If All it's right. not a rare gem, then at least it's large and looks decent. All right. Uh, I, look at, I look at the group and I say, does anyone want me to grab that out or just ignore it? Roll the I take a few steps back. Go ahead. Magpie Mer Magpie Merlin, roll. give it to me. No, roll the strength from tapping it. It seems to shift a bit when you push it. Like it's loose. Huh. I go, I just reach for it. Alright, and you pull it out? If I can, yeah. Yeah? Alright. I hold it up, Zelda, or uh, Link style, and then put it in my back if there's nothing that happens. Well, as you pull it out... Yeah. Roll me perception. Certainly. Yeah, but we're gonna... 